Yeah, it, it's a lot. I've just started a small family, so for me, having the day off in the week is a big part of you know being able to spend more time with them, especially whilst my partner's off on um, her maternity leave. The PC answer is socialising with friends, isn't it? But there's nothing better than sitting in a pub watching the football or having a pint on your way home, even with the people from work. You know, I used to work part-time here and I used to go swimming before I came to work, you know, but now I do three full days, so I do it on my days off now. <laughs> and how do you sort of find the time to do those things? Um, I think it's really important to make sure um, I'm keeping to my working hours here um, and management are really supportive of that so making sure I'm leaving on time so that I have opportunity to relax outside of work and see my friends and family and, sh and shutting off on a Friday night and, and thinking things can be picked up again on Monday. They appreciate that you need that time off to recharge your batteries so you'll get your weekends off, you'll get the day off during the week whenever you want. And how does that make you feel? Wanted. Like, you're not a unit to them, you're not a number to them. You remember a staff, you remember the family. It is easy for when everything's on rosy and everything's going really well and the results are there and so on, um, of course you're going to be treated well at that point. It's when you know things are tough for whatever reason um, when you're supported at that point that you really see, okay, what, what are the underlying principles of this, you know, this, this place that I work in? You know, what is it genuinely like? What are the people really like? And that's when I think true colours can come out. So when you see that and you like what you see in those times, then you really know that you're in a business that, you know, it's a great place to be.